Today we will take a DXF file for a custom mechanical keyboard plate and convert it into a Gerber file to order a plate from JLC, PCB, or the like. I have DXF files of a few plate designs in my documents folder here. We'll go to KiCad. We'll create a new project. Let's call it FR4 plate. And we'll open the schematic first and place a component using the A key, A, to add a mounting hole, mounting hole, and save that. Control S to save. We'll then go to open the PCB in board editor button, the top ribbon, and file import graphics and find the plate that we want to import. We'll import this on the edge cuts layer with a line width of 0 0.2 millimeters. Now that this is imported, I also like to check to make sure it is intact. So using the key combination Alt 3, we can open a 3D viewer where we should be able to see our plate in three dimensions. We can close that. I like to add a copper fill to the plate. So using the button Add Filled Zone, we can add a copper fill to the front and back, setting our clearance, or leaving our clearance in default 0, uh, 0 0.5808 millimeters and drawing a sloppy rectangle around the whole thing and hitting the key B on the keyboard to fill the copper zone. This adds a little bit of copper which changes the color slightly of the finished plate. We can save this, Control S to save, and we can export our fabrication output to be Gerber Files GBR. I like to change the output directory to include the word Gerbers with a slash on the end to indicate that it's a new directory and we'll hit plot. We'll generate drill files. Those should also be in this Gerbers output folder and generate those drill files. What we'll find is that there is a new folder in my documents called FR4 plate. And there's a Gerber's folder in there. We can take all of these files, right click or however you want, compress them to a zip. We'll call them FR4 plate Gerber's dot zip. Now let's make sure that this is actually the Gerber file that we need. Let's open up tracebase.io. This is a wonderful place to view Gerber files before you order things with them. And let's order. Let's open up our FR4 plate Gerber zip here. So there is some slight visual artifacting going on with Tracebase. Let's just change our settings here and remove a few zeros from this gap limit. That's better. Now we have our Gerbers ready to go. We can go to JLC PCB, hit the Order Now button, select our Gerber files, and in just a few seconds we'll be able to Order our plates directly from JLC PCB. Let's do black. All right, let's do white. Yeah, why not? And be sure to remove that order number so that everything is nice and smooth. There's no marks on your plate. And save to cart. It's that simple.